I humbly take the floor and welcome you all to the re-evolution. The re-evolution. Not the revolution, because we're not revolting, not wasting focus on fighting the current system, but building a new one to make the old obsolete. Yeah. The state of our world, its physical being, and our collective mental state need healing. The voices of environmentalism, gun safety pragmatism, human rights activism, finding ways to reform our economic and prison systems. Shouting dissent into the ether, hoping to catch an ear while continuing to take action year after year. Yet they have the audacity of their lack of emotional capacity not to empathize with the struggle felt by many in this mad scene. Now I don't mean angry, it's more like lunacy. A Trojan horse of democracy filled with corporatocracy. We're being fed a sack of lies, the re-evolution will not be televised. For change to come, we've got to do more, the re-evolution will not be paid for. The prevalence of these problems are ubiquitous. The issues that we're facing aren't unique to us. Sacrificing for a few at the expense of the rest of us. If we don't alter course now, it'll be the death of us. Mm. Most agree that we only have 200 years left. Damn it. People worried about profits, not the planet. Sacrificing morals just to line their own pocket. I live a comfy life, I'm kind of hesitant to stop it. I have running water, a roof over my head. I'm recently a father, my lovely wife keeps me fed. Men expand the empire, search for new land to conquer. Hunters and gatherers defeat and plunder. Vanquish territory left asunder. An imperfect messenger stands before you. Who am I? Why me? Because there's no time to waste. We must speak up when we see injustice and inequality within the human race. We're here because we want equity. The essence of being fair with impartiality. Not everything is as blatant as three-fifths of humanity. First divided by sex. Stay in the kitchen. Then divided by race. Public lynching. Then divided by faith. Murder in the name of religion. Then divided by country for the sake of the mission. Mm. All beliefs are true in the mind of the believer. What you're looking for, you will find. The mind of the seeker. But what are we seeking? We've got to sync up so the world can hear us. Orchestrate this movement. We sing in chorus. Do it for the future, for those that came before us. There's another way to view it. Here's a thesaurus. Our meeting here tonight is for new leadership. The earth yearns to be led by respectful, empathetic, loving humans instead. Patient, kind, supportive, humble, yet authoritative. It's time for a mother's love. A woman's touch. A female's guidance. A wife who can see me for what I can truly be. Those that roam the path after us will have a less tremulous road to traverse if we take up the challenge and all contribute a verse. And with that, I submit. I submit this proposal to the body for consideration. The future's feminine. I'll bring the men in them. Now's the time to change, build forward, and not sin again. So it's going to take us all to lead the resistance. The future is yours, ladies. May we be of assistance. Thank you.